Welcome to today's financial news update. Here are the latest announcements from prominent companies. ITC Limited is set to deliberate on approving the proposed scheme of arrangement amongst ITC and ITC hotels on the 6th of June. Hindustan Unilever Limited has recommended a final dividend of 24 rupees per share with a book closure from the 15th of May to the 21st of June. Larson and Tubro Limited will be considering and recommending a dividend on the 8th of May. Axis Bank Limited has recommended a final dividend of 1 rupees per share. LTI Mint Tree Limited has recommended a final dividend of 45 rupees per share, with the record dates to be intimated later. Rec Limited is set to consider and recommend a final dividend on the 30th of April. Indian Hotels CEO Limited has recommended a dividend of 1.75 rupees per share. Hindustan Petroleum Corporation Limited will deliberate on the recommendation of a final dividend on the 9th of May. Oracle Financial Services Software Limited has approved an interim dividend of 240 rupees per share, with a record date of the 7th of May. MRF Limited will consider the declaration of final dividend on the 3rd of May. Or Small Finance Bank Limited has recommended a dividend of 1 rupees per share. Damir Bharat Limited has recommended a final dividend of 5 rupees per share. Nippon Life India Asset Management Limited has recommended a final dividend of 11 rupees per share, with a payment date from the 16th of July and a record date of the 28th of June. Timken India Limited will consider the recommendation of a dividend on the 9th of May. Crompton Graves Consumer Electricals Limited will consider and recommend a final dividend on the 16th of May. Kajeria Ceramics Limited will consider and recommend a dividend on the 7th of May. Chennai Petroleum Corporation Limited has recommended a final dividend of 55 rupees per share, with the record dates to be intimated later. Blue Dart Express Limited will consider a dividend on the 2nd of May. Ram Krishna Forgings Limited has a record date for the consideration of second interim dividend on the 2nd of May. Anant Raj Limited has approved a final dividend of 0.73 rupees per share. Supreme Petrochem Limited has recommended a final dividend of 7 rupees per share, with a record date of the 27th of June. Equitas Small Finance Bank Limited has recommended a dividend of 1 rupees per share, with the record dates to be intimated later. Voltamp Transformers Limited will consider the recommendation of a dividend on the 2nd of May. Maharash Truscooters Limited has recommended a final dividend of 60 rupees per share, with a payment date from the 26th of July and a record date of the 28th of June. Gallant Icebit Limited will consider and recommend a dividend on the 2nd of May. Kenner Metal India Limited will consider the declaration of interim dividend on the 9th of May. Mars Financial Services Limited has recommended a final dividend of 0.51 rupees per share. Covey Medical Center and Hospital Limited will consider a dividend if any on the 29th of May. DCB Bank Limited has a record date to receive dividend of 1.25 rupees per share on the 10th of May.
Neogen Chemicals Limited will consider the recommendation of a final dividend on the 30th of April. Intelligent Supply Chain Infrastructure Trust has declared a distribution of 0.9030 rupees per unit, with a record date of the 26th of April. TATVH and Pharma Chem Limited will consider and recommend a final dividend on the 3rd of May. Bondader Engineering Limited will consider and recommend a final dividend on the 1st of May. Ada Welding Limited will consider and recommend a dividend on the 30th of April. PNB Gilts Limited has rescheduled its board meeting to consider the proposal for the recommendation of final dividend on the 1st of May. Agrotech Foods Limited has recommended a final dividend of 3 rupees per share. Porshack Limited will consider and recommend a dividend on the 3rd of May. Aptech Limited has a record date for dividend if any to be declared on the 2nd of May. Damper Bioorganics Limited has recommended the payment of dividend of 2.50 rupees per share, with a record date of the 28th of June. Fred and Pharmaceuticals Limited will consider and recommend a final dividend on the 7th of May. Omax Autos Limited will declare and recommend the interim dividend on the 2nd of May. Tips Industries Limited had its buyback period from the 26th of April to the 3rd of May. Jamshri Realty Limited will consider a stock split from 1000 rupees to 10 rupees on the 13th of May. Ashnor Textile Mills Limited is having a rights issue at an issue price of 20 rupees per share in rights entitlement ratio 1. 4 from the 7th of May to the 16th of May, with the last date for renunciation on the 13th of May and a record date of the 26th of April. Rapid Investments Limited has approved a rights issue for 10 crore. Detailed terms will be determined in due course. Ganesh Holdings Limited will consider raising further capital by way of rights issue on the 30th of April. Stay tuned for more updates on the financial front. Don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel for the latest news and analysis. Thanks for watching.